Hi, my name is Dana Karcher, and I'm a certified arborist with the Arbor Day Foundation, and today we're going to talk about how to choose a nursery tree. So when you're buying a tree at a nursery, you need to consider three things. Tree function, form and size, and site conditions. In considering tree function, you might want to consider a deciduous tree. It loses its leaves and allows warmth to come in in the winter, but it shades during the summer to keep you cool. You may also want to consider an evergreen tree. It provides a great windbreak or actually shields you for privacy. Or a street tree. A street tree will add value to your home and it will also help with absorbing pollutants and storm water. Another consideration when purchasing a tree at a nursery is the form and the size of the tree. You want to consider ultimately the size at maturity so that you know that the tree can fit into the right place. Consider the following when selecting a tree. Soil conditions, exposure to sun and to wind, drainage, space constraints, hardiness zone, human activity, insect and disease susceptibility, and of course, you want to look up and ensure that there are no power lines. When purchasing a containerized tree, take a look at the roots. This particular root structure is very good. We have lots of small fibrous roots. It's not root bound. The roots are not circling. They're of good size. This is what you're seeking when you purchase a containerized tree. When purchasing a bare root tree, abundant root growth, fibrous and numerous small roots, and good color are things to look for. Thanks for watching, and I hope that when you purchase your next tree, you'll keep these tips in mind. If you have any questions, feel free to reach out to us.